So I put the wind chimes back up. It's not as windy anymore. Um, today is Saturday. It's supposed to rain later on. Hopefully not. But uh, yeah, they're not blowing crazily like it was yesterday. So they're back up now. And you guys, I am about to watch the last episode of Desperate Housewives. I'm so sad. This show has been so entertaining. But you guys know when you watch a show, then when you're done, you're like, oh my God, what do I do with my life? I'm so bored. I'm not going to feel that way because even though I'm sad, it's over. Grey's Anatomy, the season that ended, is on Netflix now. So after this, I'll just start watching that. So yeah, I'm about to make something to eat. It's lunchtime and watch the last episode. I'm sad, but I'm okay with it because I have a plan. <laughs> okay, so I bought the window frames that I'm going to put the screen in that I showed you guys last vlog, I think. So this is just the screen. And I also got this, and that's just to keep the screen in. And also this little screen tool right here that you press that rope thing inside to make it stay like that. So wish me luck. I'm going to attempt to do it and I'll show you when I'm done with the first one. So have you guys ever picked up something and you're looking at the correct one to get and grab the wrong kind? Well, this wasn't the kind that I was supposed to get. Um, yeah, let me show you. So it's really sticky. Can't tell from here, but it's kind of it's kind of sticky and it feels like it comes off like that. Yeah, I don't think that's supposed to happen. Uh, I don't feel like going to the store today to return this and get the proper kind. Oh my goodness, you guys. All right, so as you guys see, I am in my car and I decided just to go to Walmart to get what I need because the I tried to make it work with the cocking thinking it was going to work and stay on there like it should. No. It's really soft and it's kind of like Play-Doh. So I don't know what I was thinking having that. But I looked at the correct one and I, for some reason, grabbed the incorrect one. So I think I know what happened. When we were in Walmart, Savannah was with me and she got a call from one of her friends and she was asking her if she wanted to go camping. And Savannah was telling me about the camping trip and stuff like that and whatever. And I'm trying to pay attention to what I'm doing. And here Savannah is trying to talk to me. So that's I believe that's the reason why I got confused and grabbed the wrong one. Vanna is camping until tomorrow. She left yesterday, which was Friday, and she has never been camping before. I have been camping when I was a teenager, but I'm not a camper. I don't do the dirt. If I ever did go camping, it would be in a full-on trailer with a working toilet, with a shower, that kind of stuff. That's the only camping I will do. And I know a lot of you, if you guys have gone camping and you probably like, that's not camping, camping is this and that. Okay, enjoy. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> anyway, it's just Cheyenne and I at the house right now. Well, in Boston. Tariq did come by yesterday to visit. So it was good to see him. And yeah, um, it really looks like it's going to rain even though the forecast changed now there's no rain I don't see any rain on the weather app but it really looks like it's gonna rain still it really looks like it's gonna rain I pulled up to Walmart but I wanted to talk to you guys for a minute before I go in before I forget so I get a kick out of so the whole wearing the mask thing that's gonna be a part of our life for a while now some stores when you go in it they're now requiring you to wear the mask and which I think is good um, some stores don't anyway so when I see people driving around by themselves in their car and their mask is on I just laugh and shake my head because I'm like people you don't need to have your mask on when you're in your own car by yourself and yeah it's just crazy to me because you need oxygen you need to breathe I mean, I get it when you go into stores, and trust me, I wear my mask in the stores. I'm about to wear it here at Walmart. So I get wearing your mask in the stores for now until this thing is dead and gone and there's no more threat of COVID, hopefully. Masks are not meant to be worn for an extended period of time. 
you know i mean like i said yes i wear mine in the store but i need oxygen so when i wear it the minute i come out i pull that sucker off because i need to breathe and sometimes it gets pretty stuffy in the mask i'm going to go in get what i need and get home it's i'm back in the car now and i kept my mask on to show you guys another thing so my pet peeve is when you go into the store and people are wearing the mask but they wear them like this or they wear them like this i even seen a worker in here just now she had the mask on like this it was a cloth mask but she had it on like this oh and then i've seen people because you know the color side is supposed to be facing out i've seen people with the color side towards their face so i'm not calling them stupid but People just need to be more educated because what's the point in wearing a mask if you're going to do this? What's the point? I mean, I don't get it. I don't get it. You might as well not wear your mask at all. I got the proper thing that I need. I don't know why in the world I got that other thing. And come on, this is in the bag. The other thing is in the box. But I'm pretty sure it's because Savannah was talking to me and distracting me and I'm just grabbing whatever so all right you guys let's go home so I can put my screen on my window and hopefully it'll work okay so you guys I did it it took a while and a little muscle work <laughs> but I did it this is the second one that I did and it came out a whole lot better than the first one of course with a lot of things but by the time I did the second one I had the flow down so all right you guys this is the first time that my kitchen nook windows have been open in a long time because I didn't want flies getting in or bugs or anything like that so it feels so good I'm so happy yes I know my windows need to be replaced is double paned and condensation gets in and that's what it looks like so that is on the list of like important things to do for my home but yeah you guys the fresh air is coming in so I bought two of these that's the black rubber thing that goes around the window and I didn't need this one but I'm keeping it it was only three dollars so who knows when I will need to use it again so that will just go right up there. Good morning, it is Wednesday and it's not even 8.30 yet and I'm up, I've showered, I got my clothes on, have that new shirt that I got on. I couldn't find anything that will cover this completely. So I'm thinking of maybe getting some material and at least sewing on here, you know, where they can't see. And I know some of you guys may say, oh, that's just a small little bit of skin, but I'm very modest for religious reasons, so to me, even this is way too much. Anyway, so um, something is happening today. I can't tell you yet. I will let you guys know everything, I promise, when I'm able to, because it's not my news. If it was my news, I would completely shout it from the rooftop, but since it's not me, but it deals with me, but it's not me, that makes any sense. I can't say anything yet. So today we are going to do something that's going to involve that. And I know you guys are probably like, well, why even tell us then? Well, you guys are my friends. Some of you guys have been with us from the very beginning. So yeah, um, I'm just thinking about what I can and cannot say. Anyway, um, if I'm able to Actually, I may do a separate video. Yes, if I'm able to tell you guys what's going on today, you'll see it in this video. But if I can't do it right now, then it'll be a separate video. How's that? Okay. Okay. So anyway, let me finish getting dressed so I can go to the place I need to go. It's about an hour away. And let's get this day started. It's going to be another hot one. It's supposed to be 102. Today. We are actually back from where we went. It was just Shine and I. Because of COVID, they only allowed so many people in the room, in the building. And we wore our masks because we were the only ones in that particular room until the worker came in. And then we put our masks back on. Um, but when it was just us in there. So anyway, I've been given permission that it's okay for me to 
show you guys and to let you guys know. So without going into too much detail, because when it comes to my kids, if they don't want to be on the camera, I won't force them to be. That's just me. Um, you guys know that. That's the reason why you guys don't see Cheyenne as often. And if they ask me not to reveal something because it is their life, whatever, I don't ever want to embarrass them or anything like that. So I don't. So with that said, I know you guys may have realized it, but you haven't seen Tyreek in the vlogs a lot. And that's because in December he moved out. I still see my son. Yes, we still talk. All that stuff. So don't think that. He is getting married. Yeah. I, I just can't believe that's come out my mouth. I've known a while now and I couldn't say anything because of course it's not my news to tell and I'm still in shock. I'm happy. I'm just, I'm still in shock. So yeah, anyway, today we went to look at dresses with his um, fiance. as mother of the groom ignore my messy bathroom and it was probably backwards I don't know so here's a better look at it I think God bless you. so somebody is under the blanket like he's all warm and cozy <laughs> <laughs> good morning everyone it's a different day and yes I do have the same shirt on that I started out in the vlog before but that's because I only had this shirt on for about an hour before I changed into the other shirt you guys seen and so here's the thing I am NOT going to put up videos of her in of her trying on wedding dresses because my son does watch the channel and even though I wouldn't put up the dress that she chose I don't think he should see her in any dress until the wedding so, with that said, the footage that I filmed the other day, I will just use it for when the wedding comes as a little pre-whatever. So, yeah. Anyway, phone is ringing, not answering it. Don't know the number. Today is Friday and it is very windy outside. I have my doors open. It's so nice. And took my wind chimes down down because they were going crazy, even though I love having them up. I actually might go out to the store before it gets too late. And by late, I mean before curfew because we do have a enforced curfew now because of the rioting. And I'm sure, well, at least I would hope they would make exceptions for people who do work at night. I don't know how that works. I did see a video of a couple getting dragged out of their car. They were just passing through. They didn't know anything about the curfew. So I don't know. I don't know. All I know is I need to do what I need to do and get back home because I don't want to be a part of the nonsense. Anyway, um, what else is going on today? Oh, I'm so excited. I have no life right now. So I'm at home and doing home improvements doing my schoolwork, which I've been kind of slacking on lately, but I did some more today. Anyway, so today, 13 Reasons Why I think the fourth season came out. Didn't start watching that one yet. And also the last and final season of Supernatural, which I do like that show. So I actually watched the first episode. So yeah, that's about it, you guys. And... Yeah, that's all that's going on right now. So my wind chimes, I know lighting's not very good. Here I am, my wind chimes are just going and going. I'm loving it. But the ones in the front, because where it is, even though it's windy, the wind doesn't reach it that often. And I barely, I'm barely hearing it. It's so windy out here, you guys. I'm out here with Boston. He's taking a potty break. What are you doing? Go use the bathroom. You 